I grew up in Poland. In 85, I jumped a ship and arrived here at Tilbury and asked for political asylum. Then I trained as an adult psychotherapist. And like many adult psychotherapists, found myself working with children and that gave me an insight and um, decided to create a training in child and adolescent psychotherapy. The beginnings of therapy were challenging. I run it on a homeless basis in various places in London, but I always had a vision that one day we'll have a home. I was always aware of this site because I live not far from here. It is a fascinating, quirky building with amazing history. It was in derelict state and was just getting worse. After we signed the lease, I didn't think that I will get all the money in one go. But hey, it happened. One million came from Heritage Lottery Fund and another million came from Elliot Simmons Charitable Trust. And then the work has started. One of our therapy rooms is also an observation room, which has a double-sided mirror with an observation area behind. We have some tray, which is kind of a main play therapy tool. Our children and young people are facing challenges the previous generation didn't. We are just trying to meet that need and hopefully make a difference. I think when we opened, I had this theory that some members of staff are coming here just to play because the objects were always moved, always in different places, although we had no clients here. <laughs> <laughs> I think the environment where you come at the time of psychological or emotional distress is important and that people feel relaxed. And for those people who provide this valuable work, it's kind of honoring the type of work we do. We have this amazing program here called the Magic Carpet, which is an interactive floor. You can actually set the fire to the whole floor. That's my favorite. I think it should be my office, this room, definitely. I absolutely love it. Maybe the fire is my favorite element, must be. Click the videos to watch more Londoners and don't forget to subscribe.